मान लीजिए ना सालिस टू में एसपी अविनाश वर्मा की भूमिका दोबारा निभाना मेरे लिए सम्मान की बात है इससे मुझे ये एहसास होता है कि जरूरत पड़ने पर पुलिस तक पहुंचना और उनकी मदद लेना कितना महत्वपूर्ण है gentlemen manoj bajpai rachi desai sahil ved vakar sheik huge round of applause for them acha aap log to aa gaye hain par hum sab jis cheez ke liye ikattha hain the trailer launch wo dekh le ek baar abhi kya abhi so i would request manoj bajpai rachi desai vakar sheik sahil ved ab kya kya nahi hua ek to aapne trailer dekha एकदम दीवार तोड़ के एंट्री मारी इन्होंने अगर आपको लग रहा है कि सरप्राइजेस आज के लिए खत्म हो गए हैं तो ऐसा बिल्कुल नहीं है एसीपी अविनाश वहां मामला कंट्रोल में है ओके नाउ द अदर अदर थिंग दैट आई वांट टू टेल यू अबाउट जो इस टीम में दो नए एंट्रेंस हैं जो ये थ्रिल क्वेश्चन और बढ़ा देंगे I'm going to take this opportunity to welcome them. Can I please have on stage Parul Gulati and Dinkar Sharma? Welcome, welcome. Hi. And can we have the mics, please? So, a photo up, ho jaye before all of you settle down. Super. Well, that's a squad we need to watch out for. So please take your seats. Uh, I'd also uh, like to have Manish Kalra, Ashima Avasti, Kiran Deohans, and Avan Deohans to please also join them on stage. Avan, ko yahan pe. Avan, we'll come there. Dinka. Avan.
my friends from media, I'm going to open it up to all of you. But before that, I get to ask one question. So I'm going to make the most of it and uh, start with the new entrance. Parul, you have written that you are your debut with the one and only Manoj Bajpai. How excited are you? I'm really excited. I, I mean, I've been around for 12 years now. Everyone thinks that Hindi film is a very good film. But this is my first film hai, and that too with the greatest cast ever. <laughs> and it is a legacy that has been carried forward from Silence One uh, with the greatest Avan ma'am. It was a pleasure working with her and then having a female DOP also. So I was like, wow, it was like meant to be. Sorry? <laughs> what do you mean, Kitty? Please elaborate. Please elaborate, Kitty. But I think we must also cheer for Pooja, who's the DOP, who joined them for the picture. <laughs> Amazing. Dinkar, how was your experience? Aap bhi new entrant hai. Did you get bullied the first day on set? Uh, no, I didn't. Soch ki jawab. Silence. <laughs> No, no, it was great fun and uh, everyone uh, was extremely supportive and I'm just very, very happy and grateful that I got this part and ma'am thought and the producers thought and everyone thought that I could, you know, uh, do this very, very important and interesting character and I'm very happy to be here. Manoji, coming to you, every time I interview you, I start you How do you become everyone's favorite with every character? But you saw him, you observed him. No, uh, I just, you uh, know, I'll, I'll take your permission just to say uh, a huge thanks to NZ Studio, Sharik Patel, Asima, and the entire team who is present here. Uh, it's been a long journey with them, and also Z5, Manish Kalra, and their entire PR team here. They, they've always taken great care of me. And yes, we fight a lot. I fight a lot with their team uh, in finding the right way uh, of pr promoting the film or finding the, finding the right groove. Uh, but I must tell you one thing. I don't do anything. I just try to be uh, a sincere slave to my director, in this case, Avan uh, Barusha Devans, who has been my friend for many years. Uh, also because uh, Kiran Devans, who is sitting here quietly, uh, and uh, believe me, believe me, no, no matter how, how well things uh, go, Kiran will always have some problem there. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, the great cinematographer of this, the, the, the great cinematographer of this country, uh, who's uh, given me a chance to work with another fantastic cinematographer, Pooja Gupte, a second time. Uh, this time, the second time I'm collaborating with her. You know, finding such uh, women force on the set, uh, uh, including Prachi uh, there, and uh, coming from uh, the last one, season one, uh, the edition one, Sahil Vaid and Vakar Sheikh. It was, it was great collaborating. I mean, for me, it's going back to the, to the same set of the people that you loved working with. I don't do anything extra. I just, uh, we just try to focus on the job and the demand of the job uh, mm -hmm. and the instruction which is coming from the director, in this case, Avan. Um, but you know what was so fascinating for me? Uh, that in, in the last one, um, uh, the, the girl Yagnik, is, uh, what was her full name? Pooja. Garima. 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 Garima Yagri. Uh, she was super lady. Super lady. And she was so young. She was so fascinating. She was so hard working. And uh, usually I don't uh, you know, get into the casting. But I was keeping my finger crossed that you know they will cast very well for, for uh, Dinka's role and uh, Paru's role. And uh, the confidence that these two have shown was quite mesmerized. Uh, Parul uh, is going to be quite a surprise uh, in this film. And Dinkar 
you know, is going to be so fascinating for the audience. Uh, he's, uh, you know, he's coming from theatre, and Parul, uh, the kind of confident lady she that she is. Uh, I've only been watching her on Instagram, and she's been uh, she she's been quite good. I mean, she has to tell me how to how to do that, how to do that. But yes, it has been a fascinating journey. I have been only learning, keeping silence. That's it. That's it. So I'm the sub bowler, but you did not let out the secret, right? which is amazing. Mike. 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 Aji, kya bol rahe? Mike. Mike. Yeh pe. But now to Prachi uh, and Vakar, you have done this second installment two times with Manoj. And you are giving high five when I told you how to do it. So I have to understand something. Who has come to understand? We have to come to understand. But you know, your characters have received so much love. Um, you know, how difficult is it to get back into that sur jise bolte na because aap us character mein ek baar phir kaise khud ko dhalte hain? Sabse pehle to mein aapko dhaun ki jab bhi aap dousra season ya dousra edition kar rahe hote hain, you have to revisit the first one. Because eventually what happens is that there is a gap and you have moved on from there. You have grown as an actor. You have grown as a, as a person. But there is, there are a few basic elements that uh, you have uh, done in the in the previous one. You should not leave that, you know, because that is the main, that that is the crux of the character. Yes, the character, even the character ha is coming after such a uh, long gap. So he is also going to be uh, a person. Or the character with the growth, but there are basic things, basic uh, qualities, or the or the disadvantages of the character that you should always always keep, no, not not to leave leave it behind. Uh, when I was doing it, I watched the first one first hand, tried to remind myself uh, uh, what I have done and what I should do now, because there there is a certain part of Avinash Sharma which is not heavily touched upon by the writer and director. Uh, not even in the first one, not even in the second one. But that's the seed of, the, of his character. And uh, my, the character's journey is taken from there. My anger, my loneliness, uh, the character's loneliness is coming from there. So that, I kept on reminding myself. Whenever I was sitting on the set, I kept on reminding myself about the back story or the, or the, sto the personal story of this man, where he's coming from. I kept on reminding myself. And, the, and now he's on the job. So mostly when you see him, he's on the job. There is a very 2% uh, that Avan has given to Avinash Verma uh, about his other side that uh, audience get to see. But that is the, that is the seed of his making, okay? So yes, uh, that was the basic uh, base of my dad. Always such a pleasure listening to you, Mahimji. Uh, my question now to Prachi, aapka kirdar bhi kis tarikhe se, what was your process of getting into the skin of that character? Uh, you know, honestly, to begin with, just the joy of coming back to this scene was boundless. You know, I mean, the minute we, I got the call at least, I was like, absolutely, when? Um, and, you know, there are some things about uh, the role, like Manotsa said, which of course you have to revisit. But personally, I felt that there are so many things that beautifully come to you when you're in motion. So your body language from the first film, you know, which is sort of muscle memory, it comes back to you on the second or the third or the fourth day. Um, the camaraderie that we share, uh, I think that bond, is so great that the second time around, um, we were genuinely great friends on the set. And that just made our job easier. So every time we were within a scene, uh, nobody had to worry about breaking the ice or getting to know another, no, none of that. I mean, I think we were kind of able to bring in that friendship on screen because all of us bonded really well off screen. 
Um, and this time around, I think we knew Aban ma'am uh, that well, where we kind of know where she's coming from when we are uh, executing scenes, we know her working style, all of that. I think that really added to it because genuinely this time, there was a lot more work. There are so many murders happening and there's that much more work to do. I mean, we are all on our toes. So um, yeah, this time I think that friendship helped, but uh, also yes. Then. Not every day you get to hear so many murders happening. <laughs> we got just, just, just a regular cop life, guys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'd like to bring in Sai at, at this point of time. Uh, like she said, I'm sure the the energy on set would be very different. A born banchika hota hai. Aap log, you know, you're you're back there with those characters. सबसे बड़ी लर्निंग क्या रही है? लर्निंग रही है सेट पे मनोज सर यूज़ टू सिट इन द सेंटर लाइक अ सेंसे एंड वी यूज़ टू सिट अराउंड हिम आस्क हिम लाइफ क्वेश्चंस आस्क हिम कैरेक्टर क्वेश्चंस ही वुड ऑलवेज हैव एन आउट डोंट वी ऑल ही ही ऑलवेज हैज दिस ही हैज इंटेंस आईज एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ़ and then he gauges it and then he realizes ki nahi yaar ye dil se sawal puch raha hai and then he goes sahil aise karo and then it happens be it life be it be it the film be it anything he has answers he is a sensei <laughs> so cool so cool uh vakar aap bataiye uh, how was how was your experience and how have you evolved as a person as an actor now with Silence too. See, as uh, Prachi also said, it was not very difficult because we were silence one karke aaye the. So the characters are the same, and uh, we've gelled so nicely in silence one. So there was no breaking ice again. We bonded as if jahan se choda tha wahi se shuru kiya. We know Aban Ma'am's uh, style of uh, direction. Uh, characters, we've already played that character. And for me personally, my biggest kick is standing in the same frame with Mr. Bajpai. मतलब इससे बड़ा कुछ और हो ही नहीं सकता। आप एक complete institution के साथ एक ही frame में खड़े हो, इससे बड़ा मेली achievement कुछ नहीं है। And it just makes your job very easy when you're working with him. And scripts इतनी detailed है कि आपको बहुत ज़्यादा सोचना नहीं है। आप just be with your character that you played in Silence One. Continue with that same honesty. And uh, that's it. Gets very easy. And हम लोग तो आधा टाइम आओ में रहते हैं सर से हवा भी सवाल पूछते रहते हैं कि कैसे कर लेते हो। I also feel that I didn't say it, but then sense it. Yeah, totally got that. You know, I I now now like to get the director and producer in. Producer तो बिल्कुल चुप, कुछ भी नहीं बोल रहे। Like the only one here who's taking silence very seriously is you. And uh, uh, you know, उन्होंने कई बार जब वो लोग बात कर रहे थे about being on set and how when Manoj was saying कि आपने character में क्या-क्या डाला तो आप हंस रहे थे, ठीक है? ये ये director का दुख है कि इतनी मेहनत करनी पड़ी या कि ऐसी cast ले आओ कि मेहनत फिर करने की जरूरत ही नहीं होती। No no they were all fantastic. In fact I would say कि Manoj would put on his mustache, he would wear his shakti. And he was ACP Avinash Verma. And then he was that the badass cop. He was the one, you know, who will not tolerate nonsense. He will look at you with that intense eyes. And all of them would react like little mice the minute he looks like that. So, <laughs> so yeah, but we had so much fun on the set. And like they were mentioning, there was so much camaraderie. The actors knew their characters. So uh, that made my my uh, part so much easier for the second installment. So character-wise, that was the thing. This was, of course, a more, um, well, I would say, more difficult film because uh, it had more layers. It's character, other characters as well were more complex. So for him, I think it was the, you know, the whole thing was like an onion, where ACP Avinash Varma had to peel off every layer till he reached. Trucks. Lovely. We can't wait to watch the film, but I think everyone's itching to ask you questions. So I'm going to open it up to everyone here. Do we have no, a I mic just, there? I just want to say yes. thanks to uh, Kiran Devans for, for really uh, treating us with chicken lollipop every day. 
Wow. Yeah. So I like to work with you. Lollipop. <laughs> I know. I I always try to find it on every set, but they fail to give it to me. But uh, Kiran, thank you very much for chicken lollipops. <laughs> Most <laughs> welcome, Manoj. Thank you, Kiran. Sir. Thank you so much. <laughs> Super guys, are you ready for the question? Yes, please. That, <laughs> that I think filmmaking was little more than chicken lollipop on the set. As as Aban put it very simply, that uh, the way uh, the whole thing happened. But uh, the more we went through the shooting, we realized that it is not a very simple film. Hmm. It's a very intricate. An interactive si silence to now, and I don't know how she writes it because it's damn difficult to write murder mystery. There are very few female, I think, yeah, writers yeah. and directors, uh, and uh, it's a very difficult genre because the audience is interacting continuously with the, with the yeah. film. So um, I think <laughs> the chicken lollipop was just to ease the tension on the set. <laughs> <laughs> we get it, sir. We so know you did a lot to. more than just so you that. Are, yes, <laughs> Kiran, you are not. You are not allowed to say nice things about Avan <laughs> because you have said it all your life. Whoever will know, boy. But I must say that I, this is my fourth film with Manoj. Yes. Starting from Ax to Hanan. Hanan, you must have seen somewhere. Yes. And these two, he is such a pleasure to work with. On the set, as a DOP, as a producer, all of us, everybody from the cast and crew, first AD, second AD, everybody was like a friend to Manoj. Like the first AD, Zetanya and Dev and all this gang, they were like uh, not afraid of speaking to Manoj. Normally, when the star of his level is on the set, there's a hush hush, and you know, before you suggest him something, you think twice. But here it was really no wall, whether it's director talking to him or the third AD speaking to him. It was such a beautiful atmosphere. Thanks to him only because. He from right there. Yeah. You know, right yeah. now. So he actually made people so comfortable. All the actors, the cast, crew. He would fool around with everybody. So there was never a moment where we felt, uh, oh my God, wow, you know, uh, Manoj has come on the set. We would only get stressed, you know, when? Because when the call time would be like 8 o'clock and Manoj would arrive at 7. Oh. <laughs> and we're like, what? He's already there? <laughs> And they were like, oh shit, oh shit, go fast. <laughs> I have to add one thing. Like, before silence, one was made. Yeah. When the script was ready, and I think that was COVID time, we went and narrated to Ashima. And it, see, normally, uh, just a normal thriller is okay, but this is a little difficult script. Mm -hmm. So we were a little skeptical that what will happen, Ashima will not come, but uh, one narration, I think, she was green lighting it, which was a I mean, little surprise, and we were happy about it yeah. because these kind of projects don't get greenlit so easily. Yeah. And Manoj had greenlit also. So I think uh, the more uh, people uh, write this kind of stuff, you'll have a variety of cinema. Exactly. And there are actors like Manoj accepting it because he's changing every time. But I know what the most good thing is that when we talk about directors, where we are you know, uh, breaking the stereotype here, whenever we are talking about the women directors, we are talking, you know, they have some kuch so that relationship pe koi film aayegi. Ek particular genre mein hi. Ek particular yeah. genre nahi. Ye murder mystery, uh, Aban they once, I, yeah. been, I know her for so many years. Uh, ye sirf aur sirf murder mystery wali kahaniya hi padhti hai. <laughs> Kisne kisko maara aur kaise maara. <laughs> so I was always very afraid of, for Kiran Devans, my friend. But thankfully, he survived. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but also, how beautifully she broke the stereotypes. So yeah. thank you for for making something like this. It really looks <laughs> very thrilling. Guys, now it's over to you, my friends from uh, the media. Do we have a mic there? Hello. Hi. Yeah. Uh, my name is Aina from Instant Bollywood. My question is to Manish Kalra. My the question is that, you know, the financial year has just started and it started with a property like Silence 2. How do you think the year is looking ahead for Z5? Really, it's, uh, year is looking really exciting for us. We have a great lineup. Uh, Manoj is a part of many of them. <laughs> uh, we have the, I always call that uh, Manoj is the superstar of OTT, so... <laughs> Yeah, uh, she asked that uh, Manoj is the face of Z. Yeah, I was like, yeah, he is the face of Z, so why not? 
So anyway, it's a great lineup uh, with amazing uh, actors with some great plots. Uh, we have a mix of good originals, uh, which are OCs and web series, as well as movies and uh, theatrical. So you will kind of see a amazing, exciting lineup from Z5, and customers would be hopefully very really interested and excited. Yeah. Hi, I have a question for Manoj sir. Uh, Manoj sir, silence does not have to be that all dark and sinister word. Uh, you have been constantly maintaining in all your interviews that when things were not going right for you, mm -hmm. you chose to go inward. You chose to maintain that silence and find that sense of spirituality through silence by going deep within you. When things also get ultra competitive, perhaps toxic, uh, you also chose to do that. Can you please shed light on the same, the significance of silence? Aapka raapta silence se kitna tagda hai? Us par... Main hindi, mein, hindi mein jawab doon isko? Yeah, both. Yeah. Achha, do tarikhe ke chuppi, aapne ek, ek baat ki chuppi, do tarikhe ki, do tien tarikhe ki hoti hai. Pahli ye hoti hai ki, jab aap jeevan mein, uh, aapke tufaan aa rahe hoote hai, mera hamesha maanna hai ki basement mein jana bahut achha rehta hai. कि तूफान घर को लेके चला जाएगा बेसमेंट में अगर आप रहेंगे तो आपको नहीं छुपाएगा बेसमेंट का मतलब वो ये होता है कि चुप होकर के अपनी यात्रा को सोचना और देखना कि आपने क्या सही किया और क्या गलत किया क्योंकि तूफान के साथ में आप छाती खोल के खड़ा नहीं रह सकते हैं ज़्यादा सही होता है कि आप अपने अंदर झाँक के देखें कि आपने क्या सही किया क्या गलत किया और जहाँ तक बात है दूसरे साइलेंस की तो आ, दूसरा साइलेंस ये होता है कि जब चीज़ें आपके आसपास बहुत ज़्यादा उलझ गई हों तो आप बात करके उसको सुलझा नहीं कर सकते हैं सारे पर्सपेक्टिव से उस चीज़ को देखना होता है और साइलेंटली उसको एनालाइज करना होता है और तभी जा कर के आप किसी मकाम पे किसी कंक्लूजन में पहुंच सकते हैं तो वो साइलेंस ये साइलेंस है दूसरा वाला हाय सेंटर मयूर यर फ्रॉम बियॉन्ड बॉलीवुड मेरा सवाल मनोज जी से है सर uh, मैंने uh, एक आपके एक इंटरव्यू में आपने बड़ी खूबसूरत बात कही थी कि सिनेमा से अगर वाकई कुछ बदल सिर्फ अगर कुछ बदल सकता है तो वो है लोगों के हेयर स्टाइल uh, तो सर अगर आप मेरी uh, टाट देख पा रहे हो uh, तो कुछ बता सकते हैं कि मुझे किसका हेयर स्टाइल फॉलो करना चाहिए नहीं वो पारुल वो चीज़ बेचती है पारुल 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 वो बालों के वो सारी चीज़ें बेचती हैं जिससे कि आप किसी भी एक्टर का हेयर स्टाइल पा सकते हैं थैंक यू थैंक यू आजकल 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 इंस्टाग्राम वो काम कर रहा है ये मैंने बालों पे लगाया आपको चाहिए तो कांटेक्ट जी जी शाइन है शाइन है शाइन हेयर पारुल अपना इंस्टाग्राम हैंडल बता दो निश हैर निश हैर तो आपने समझ लिया ओके पारुल तुम्हारा काम हो गया थैंक यू सर अब मैं चली जाती हूँ निश हैर गाइस और साइलेंस टू देख लेना नहीं मतलब मैं मैं बड़ी बड़ी सी मैं इसको मजाक में कभी नहीं बोलता हूँ कहीं ना कहीं सिनेमा जो है सिनेमा हमारे समय को रिफ्लेक्ट करता है हमारे हमारे समय का मिरर हो सकता है आईना हो सकता है सिनेमा मूवमेंट क्रिएट नहीं कर सकता सिनेमा मूवमेंट का पार्ट हो सकता है इसीलिए मैंने हमेशा कहा कि सिनेमा अकेले कुछ नहीं बदलता है सिनेमा एक आंदोलन का पार्ट हो सकता है एक मूवमेंट का पार्ट हो सकता है नहीं तो अगर आप देखें तो हर तरीके के लोगों ने हर तरीके के शासक ने अपने अपने तरीके से सिनेमा सिनेमा या आर्ट फॉर्म को यूज़ किया है तो आप क्या क्या बोलेंगे उसको क्योंकि वो सिनेमा या कोई भी आर्ट फॉर्म उसका हिस्सा हो सकता है कभी भी वो दिशा नहीं दिखा सकता है वो आ, मेरे समय को दिखा सकता है जब अमित अमिताभ बच्चन जी एंग्री मैन के तौर पे आए थे तो बेरोज़गारी थी निराशावाद था होपलेसनेस जिसको कहते हैं उस समय आम आदमी को पता नहीं था कि अपने आप को वेंट आउट कैसे करे कहाँ पे देखे तो उन अमिताभ बच्चन जी में उन्होंने अपना अपने आप को देखा और वहाँ पर उनकी फिल्में देख करके उन्होंने वेंट आउट किया उनको लगा कि ये मैं हूँ जो सामने खड़ा है और वो दुनिया से वो सिस्टम से लड़ रहा है तो इसी तरीके से जब रोमांटिसिज्म का समय आता है तो शम्मी कपूर हुए 
और हमारे आपके समय में सलमान शाहरुख और आमिर हुए तो हम लोग हम जो सिनेमा देखते हैं वो हमारे दौर का आईना होता है वो खुद में कोई आंदोलन और या मूवमेंट नहीं होता है हेलो मेरा मैं दैनिक जागरण से दीपेश पांडे सर uh, मेरा सवाल बनो सर आपसे और प्राची आपसे रहेगा क्योंकि क्योंकि आप दोनों फिल्म में पुलिस ऑफिसर का कैरेक्टर प्ले कर रहे हैं तो मैं आपसे वो पुलिस डिपार्टमेंट से जुड़ा कोई ऐसा यादगार एक्सपीरियंस जानना चाहूँगा जो पुलिस नाम सुनते हैं सबसे पहले आप लोगों के कोई मत करना पजल मत करना फेल हो जाएंगे सब के सब यहाँ पे सब चिकन लॉलीपॉप खाने में व्यस्त थे <laughs> जी जी सॉरी तो आ, मैं पूछ रहा था कि आप लोग का आ, कुछ ऐसा एक्सपीरियंस जो पुलिस नाम सुनते हैं पुलिस डिपार्टमेंट नाम सुनते ही आ, सबसे पहले वो इंसिडेंट याद आता हो आप दोनों से मुझे सबसे पहले नाम याद मतलब कोई इंसिडेंट याद आता हो मेरे जीवन में मैं देखिए मैं गांव का हूँ तो हमारे गांव में दरोगा साहब जो थे वो सबसे बड़े आदमी हुआ करते थे तो दरोगा साहब की अगर गाड़ी हमारे गांव घर पे लगती थी वो चाहे भले ही चाय पीने आ रहे हों लेकिन सबसे पहले हमारी फट जाती थी कि पता नहीं दरोगा साहब और उनके लोग क्यों आ गए पुलिस के नाम से सबके क्योंकि कानून और लॉ इन्फोर्समेंट का सबसे बड़ा काम उनके ऊपर होता है तो सबसे आ, बड़ी जिम्मेदारी उनके ऊपर होती है तो अगर पुलिस की गाड़ी कहीं से गुजरती है और लोगों के अंदर में या तो एक एक अश्योरेंस होता है कि वो सुरक्षित हैं या जो अगर आप कुछ भी ऐसा गलत काम कर रहे हैं तो आपको डर लगे कि आप आपके ऊपर खतरा है तो ये एक बड़ी अच्छी बात है हमारे अभी जब मैं गांव जाता हूं तो अपने लोकल हमारे जितने भी दरोगा साहब लोग हैं वो सब थाने के लोग सब मिलते हैं एंड आई रियलाइज़ कि इन लोगों का काम कितना भारी है लॉ इन्फोर्समेंट किसी भी इलाके में जैसे मैं ओशीवारा के इलाके में हूँ तो ओशीवारा के कभी पुलिस स्टेशन में ऐसे ही चाय पीने जाता हूँ और वहाँ पर पता चलता है कि आ, किस किस तरीके के क्राइम हो रहे हैं और कैसे कैसे वो लोग डील कर रहे हैं तब पता चलता है कि इनकी ज़िंदगी कितनी कठिन है कि अपनी ज़िंदगी अपने पूरे पर्सनल जीवन को जो इनका जो व्यक्तिगत जीवन है उसको छोड़ के उसको त्याग करके कम्प्लीटली एक केस पे पुलिस स्टेशन पे उनको लगे रहना पड़ता है कभी कभी तो ऐसा होता है कि जैसे ही वो स्टेशन से अपने घर की तरफ गए बीच से ही उनको बुला लिया जाता है तो आप समझ सकते हैं कि उनका पर्सनल लाइफ कितना कितना अफेक्टेड होता है तो फॉर मी देखिए जो पुलिस लाइन के लोग हैं पुलिस वाले जितने भी हैं उनके लिए बहुत ज़्यादा सिंपति है अगर आप मुझे इंसिडेंट्स बोलेंगे कि ये तो यहाँ पे पुलिस वाले ऐसे हुए वहाँ पे पुलिस वालों ने ये कुछ गलत किया तो यार वो एक्सेप्शन डजेंट मेक द रूल फॉर मी व्हाट आई नो जो शूल करते हुए जो मैंने रिसर्च किया था कि जो पुलिस वालों की ज़िंदगी है वो वो अज, वो एक कमाल है कि पब्लिक में उनके लिए अनग्रेटफुलनेस है लेकिन उनको दिन रात अपने परिवार के सुख को त्याग करके अपना सुख को त्याग करके 24 घंटे वो आपके लॉ इन लॉ लॉ एनफोर्समेंट डिपार्टमेंट को संभालना पड़ता है सो दिस इज़ हेल ऑफ अ जॉब जो हम सोचते नहीं हैं देर आर फ्यू इंस्टेंसेस आप जहाँ पे कह सकते हैं कि पुलिस यहाँ पे पुलिस ने गलत किया लेकिन देर आर अदर नाइन्टी परसेंट इंस्टेंसेज वेर यू विल सी वट बिकॉज ऑफ द पुलिस डिपार्टमेंट that we have always been feeling safe yeah. on that note uh, do we have any other question because i'm afraid we've completely run out of time anyone uh, we have time for just one more okay.
सर यहाँ पर तो मैं स्टूडियो के बाहर था आई वॉज अलाउड ऑन द सेट चिकन लॉली पर बनवा रहे मैं मनोज सर की सेवा कर रहा था पूरी यूनिट की और मैडम अंदर जी ओ पी हमारी पूजा गुप्ते और जो भी है इन दोनों का है आभार मैडम का रंग का मेरा मतलब टोटली प्रोडक्शन फोकस था और कुछ नहीं तो थैंक यू फॉर सेइंग दैट बट इट वाज दिस बट बट सिंस वी आर रैपिंग अप स्टूडी इट विल बी वेरी इट विल नॉट बी वाइज विदाउट टेकिंग द नेम ऑफ द क्रू हु सिटिंग हियर ऑल द असिस्टेंट डिरेक्टर्स एंड प्रोडक्शन पीपल करण एंड तान्या एंड देव एंड एवरी वन इज सिटिंग देयर थैंक यू वेरी मच थैंक यू thank you uh, over here i have one question over here yeah ji are acha laga aapko chaliye ek dukaan aur khul gayi meri nahi sir main to cha raha hu ki log bulaye main main paise kisko pure lagte hain sir नहीं लेकिन बहुत मज़ा आया मैंने पहली बार किया और मुझे सबसे अच्छी बात ये लगी कि एक एंकर के ऊपर होता है कि वो अपने जो गेस्ट आते हैं जो स्टेज पे आते हैं उसके ऊपर होता है कि वो सवाल किस तरीके से करे और कैसे करे ताकि वो जो गेस्ट स्टेज पे आ रहे हैं वो पूरी तरीके से कंफर्टेबल हों और पूरा माहौल जो है न सिर्फ मज़े का हो एक एंटरटेनमेंट भी हो लेकिन हमको प्रोजेक्ट के बारे में उस कंटेंट के बारे में दर्शकों को पूरी तरीके से पता भी चल जाए तो एक नई चीज़ सीखी मैंने और शायद करते करते और भी अच्छा करूंगा मैं बट आई इन्जॉयड इट क्वाइट अलॉ थैंक यू सो आई एम सो सॉरी टू कट यू बट ए सी पी अविनाश है ना बिल्कुल कम्प्लीटली रन आउट ऑफ टाइम Uh, hello sir uh, and uh, hello to the entire team as well and i think uh, sabse pehle i think everybody should give a huge shout out to z5 i think we are attending an event uh, from there and after a long time and we have missed that as well so sabse pehle silence 2 ke liye a huge congratulations to the entire team manoj sir you. as well lots of love always thank you uh, my question right now is to prachi would be ki um, you know uh, right from your very first show right uh, people have given you a different level of love affection jo ki raha hai aapke sath and beej uh, beej mein people have missed you as well and jo usko kehte hum log like you know silence in uh, you know matlab that visibility that perhaps a lot of people missed as well uh, and you know when visibility is missing even if there's a lot of quality in the person uh, people raise questions right mujhe batao koi ek aisa instance tumhare uh, professional zindagi mein where all this silence and all these critics jinhone shayad aapko criticize kiya tha for whatever reasons which were not relevant to your work आपने उनको कैसे साइलेंस किया ऐसा कोई एक किस्सा बताइए प्लीज मुझे किसने कब क्रिटिसाइज किया मैं जस्ट जस्ट बट थैंक यू आई एम गोइंग टू से आई गेस वो जितने भी बार आपने मुझे मिस किया थैंक यू फॉर सेइंग दैट बट मुझे लग रहा है कि वेन एवर जी कॉल्स ना आई एम देर सो वेदर इट वॉज माई फर्स्ट शो विच वॉज ऑन जी एंड देन ऑफकोर्स यू नो वी है but what can i say i think you know um, i'm the kind of person who embraces silence and mai apne silence ke sath bahut comfortable ho chuki hu so like manoj sir said there are kinds of silences that you experience in life the main one the most important one as an actor which i learned over the years waqt uh, laga but it is silencing the voice and the noise of everybody else uh, once you start doing what you want to do and what is true to you i guess um, that's when you have more fun with it and since then you've been seeing a lot more of me on screen so i guess somewhere i'm doing getting that right yeah thank you thank you thank you, thank you. to team silence 2 thank you thank you for the fabulous trailer and we can't wait to watch the film and to all of you thank you for taking out the time to be here Okay so we we are, you're going to now pose for pictures so all the <laughs> I am heading program thank you my the varas shilpa thank you thank you i acted in a film sir
नीचे बैठो अरे मोबाइल ये थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू थैंक यू नहीं चाहिए थैंक यू बाहर करेंगे मोबाइल किसका है बे थैंक यू आइए प्राची